Hi everyone, I am available for all sort of my lab courses, MS Excel, MS Word, MS PowerPoint, MS Access Mathematics, Accounting and Statistics, Problems Rock. Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's session, we are taking what chapter two simulation training. I will guide you through this training step by step, making it easy for you to follow and you can run your training by watching this video. You can contact me for your assignments, exam, quiz and for a complete course on my WhatsApp and email. My WhatsApp and email are given in the description and shown on my PC screen. I can do all online courses, accounting, finance, math, Excel, Word, PowerPoint. Assess Writing, Economics, Java, C++, Python and many more online courses. Let's start our training. To solve it step by step, select all document text, change font to theme, new Roman and then font size to 12 point. Ok, first we will select all document and then go to the home tab and then we will change the font to new, change to time, new Roman. We will change the font theme to Time New Roman, scroll down and then apply Time New Roman. Okay, select all document. Okay, sorry. Then font size to 12, go to the home tab and then apply font size to 12 point. Select the second paragraph in the document, courtesy of Philips Studio L Photography, then apply italic. Okay, now we will select second photo, uh, second document, second paragraph in the documents and then apply italic. Go to the home tab and then apply italic. Now, select the five paragraph beginning with compose with care and then ending with behold. Be bold. Click the font dialog box, launcher bold, the selection and then select small caps effort, close the dialog box. Beginning with Compose and then ending with Be Bold. Click the Font Dialog Box, Launcher Bold, the Selection and then select Small Caps. Okay, go to the Font Group and then apply Small Caps Effect and then go to the Font Size and go to the Font Group and then apply Bold. Go to the font group and then we will apply bold on this. Apply bold. Ok, select the last paragraph. Let Philips Studio L photography preserve your memories. Format the selected text with text effect to fill. Blue accent color 5, outline with background color 1, hard shadow blue accent color 5. Select the last paragraph. And then let Philips Studio L photography preserve your memories. Okay, select this paragraph. Or made the selected text with text effect to fill blue accent color 5. Blue accent color 5, outline white background color 1. Go to the font and then fill blue accent 1. Hot shadow blue accent 5. Okay, play this. Now select the words you should. Consider how to become a better photographer in the in the paragraph under the composition heading click text highlights ok you can see here scroll up how to become a better compose after refer to how to become a better photographer in the paragraph under the composition heading. Click text highlight color on the home tab in the font group to highlight the text using the default yellow highlight color. Ok, 
Okay, go to the font group and then apply yellow highlights. Color question is completed now. Select the text in the first body paragraph beginning with if you enjoy taking digital picture and then ending with when talk, uh, taking pictures and change the length space spacing to 1.5 do not deselect de the text ok select the text the first body paragraph be beginning with if you can enjoy ok if you can enjoy is here you can see here ok and then change the length spacing to 1.5 do not select the text go to the paragraph group and then go to the length spacing apply 1.5 length spacing change the alignment of the selected text to justify do not select the text change the alignment of the selected text to justify ok change the alignment of the selected text to justify do not deselect the text you can see here go to the paragraph group and then apply justify alignment change the spacing after of the selected text to 6 point change the spacing after of the selected text to 6 point go to the paragraph group and then go to the spacing after 6 point you can see here we will apply 6 point after spacing and then click on ok Place the insertion point after the second paragraph. Courtesy of Philips Studio L Photography. Click the insert lab. Click sample. Click more samples and then insert register samples from the special characters. Go to the insert tab. Go to the samples and then more samples and then Go to some courtesy of Philip Lab Photography, click the insert tab and click sample and click both sample and then click a register sample from the special character. Register sample from the special character you can see here. Okay. Special character tab. Click on and close it. Okay. Change the alignment of the second paragraph courtesy of Philip Studio Lab Photography to align right. Okay. We will change the alignment of second paragraph what is your Philips studio and photography to align right you can select for this second par paragraph alignment of second paragraph align right go to the home tab go to the alignment tab and then apply align right scroll to page 4 and then select the 4 paragraph beginning with Barry image due to focus. Okay, scroll the scroll to page four and then select the paragraph beginning with Barry image due to focus and ending with that cracks a bit of shake. Click the paragraph setting dialog box launcher and then apply left indent of 0 0.5 inches. You can see here first scroll to page four and select four paragraph beginning with Barry image ok then select the 4 paragraph beginning with blurry image due to focus then ending with that corrects for a bit of shape ok then click a paragraph setting go to the paragraph group click the paragraph setting dialog box then launcher and apply a left indent of 1.5 inches you can see then select for this and then we will click the paragraph setting dialog box we will click a paragraph setting dialog box sorry need to select this again but we may due to focus 
and then bit of shake ending with the bit of shake okay then click the paragraph setting dialog box launcher and then apply your left indent here is left indent to 1.5 inches 1.5 inches then click on ok question is completed now you can see on my pc screen Place the insertion point at the end of document, display the ruler set or left align, tap stop at the 1 inches mark on the horizontal ruler. You can see place the insertion point at the end of the document, display the ruler, set or left align, tap stop at the, go to the view tab and then display the ruler, ok set or left a line tap stop at the 1 inches mark on the horizontal ruler. Ok, one point. Ok, question is done. Change the tab selector to a right tab and then click at 5.5 inches on the ruler to set a right tab. Right tab. Open the paragraph dialog box. Click tab to open the tabs dialog box. Click the 5.5 tabs and select a dot leader. Click OK. Go to the home tab. Open the paragraph dialog box and then click on tabs and then click the 5.5 inches and select a dot. Click on dot bar. Select a dot leader and then click OK. Now press tab, tab Monday, Friday and then press tab, tab, first we will press tab and then tab Monday, Friday, M O N D Monday and then Friday and then press tab and then tab 9 to 4, 9 double to 4. Okay, then press tab and then tap Saturday. Then press tab and then tap Saturday. Then tap Saturday. Okay. Then press tab and then tap 9 to 2. 9 to okay. Then press enter and then press tab and then tap close Sunday. Ok, then press enter, after this we will press enter and then we will press tab and then tap close Sunday. Close Sunday. Ok, select the three paragraph at the end of document beginning with Monday, Friday and then ending with the close Sunday. Open the borders and shading dialog box. Ok, select three paragraph and the documents beginning with Monday, Friday and then ending with close Sunday. Sunday, go to the paragraph and then we will apply the borders, border and shading, display the border tab in the borders and shading dialog box, select the shadow border setting with the double underline border stride, click ok, apply double, double underline border style, double underline border style and then click ok, do not deselect text, ok, change shading to blue accent 1 letter 60 percent, ok, go to the shading and then apply shading, blue accent 1 letter 60 percent, here is blue accent 1 letter 60 percent, ok, click on ok, this is good now, click on OK, question is completed now. At the beginning of the document, select the 5 bolded paragraph, beginning with compose, with care and then ending with be bold. Ok, at the beginning of the document, select the 5 
select the five bolded paragraph beginning with compose with care and then ending with be bold click the numbering arrow and then select the last option on the first row in the numbering library okay click the numbering arrow and then select the last option on the first row click numbering arrow last option in the on the first arrow okay scroll the depth of field uh, section on page 2 and then select the four paragraph beginning with aperture f stop and then ending with point of view apply a hollow round bullet to the selected paragraph okay on page 2 select the fourth paragraph beginning with aperture okay you can see beginning with aperture and then ending with point of view then apply a hello sorry apply a hollow round bullet to the selected paragraph go to the bullets tab and then apply round bullet scroll the last page and then select the last six body paragraph beginning with wear kids last paragraph and then select it beginning with wear kids and then involved or uh, ending with before even getting center okay wear kids beginning with wear kids is here you can see and then ending with greeting center apply hollow round bullet to the selected paragraph we will apply hollow round bullet to the selected paragraph okay question is completed now you can see here i have done half simulation training and for many question and if you want to do for complete course you can contact me on my whatsapp and email my whatsapp and email are given in the description and shown on my pc screen i can do all online courses accounting finance math excel word powerpoint assess writing economics java c++ python and many more online courses i am also handling many students courses on pearson sandgate blackboard and many more colleges and universities please help me for your weekly quizzes and please help me for your weekly assignments and help me for your complete course read i will provide you a plus grade in your all assignments and your all quizzes and your all exams and complete course thanks for watching my video please subscribe my channel and like my video best of luck to my all students thank you so much